Need some fresh strategies for generating more income with affiliate marketing? Over the past few years, I've posted hundreds of videos and generated hundreds of thousands of dollars of income with affiliate marketing. And in this video, I'm gonna be breaking down five of my best strategies, coming up. Hey, what's up? Sean here with Think Media, bringing you the best tips and tools for building your influence with online video. And we're in the middle of our affiliate marketing series. And actually, in part one, we talked about the basics of affiliate marketing. Part two, we covered some of the advanced strategies. And if you haven't seen those yet, you can check out the playlist on the YouTube card, and we'll also link to it in the description below. But in this third part, I share five more of my biggest tips for generating serious income with affiliate marketing. And this is actually a portion of a talk that I did at VidSum it in LA. It's put on by Daryl Eaves and it was really cool to be able to speak at an event with Gary Vaynerchuk and Peter McKinnon and Sarah Dietschy and, and really talk about some of the most powerful strategies I've learned over the last few years generating multiple six figures of income with YouTube and affiliate marketing. And so let's cut over to the content and then afterwards I've got some bonus videos and resources that I know you're going to love so I'll see you soon. Tip number six is higher ticket, higher commissions. So ask yourself, what is the affiliate marketing commission percentage of whatever it is you're promoting? Every program will tell you. It might be 4%. It might be 10%. On Amazon, it's between like 4 to 10%. Um, you know, on different software programs, it could be much higher. It might be 30, 40, 50. There's 80% affiliate commissions that you can get. You also want to ask, how much does the product itself cost? So if we're talking about how to generate six figures with affiliate marketing, then ultimately you want to be researching uh, some of these questions and go higher ticket. So this is Timothy. He's part of the uh, Think Media community and a part of some of our advanced training. And you know he covers a lot of tech, but he really goes deep in drones. And so he's made, you know, by now, this is an old screenshot, like maybe over $20,000 of income from DJI directly, the DJI affiliate program. Why? Because it's a higher ticket item. If you're talking about something higher ticket, people are discovering you. By nature, you're going to earn more. You know, some people, if you're just talking about like budget cosmetics, you just have to audit the profit potential of this monetization strategy. You've been here at VidSummit. How many of you love VidSummit? Can we just give it up for VidSummit? Yeah. So thankful for Daryl, all the volunteers, all the team. Absolutely an incredible event. And you've probably learned about brand deals. You've learned about other ways to make money. It's different in different industries. But here at VidSummit, right, we're learning about different things. If you are doing budget cosmetics, even if you do high volume and it's a $2 lipstick, you might not earn that much. But if you go higher ticket, you can get also higher commissions, right? And then another thing could be higher percentage, higher commissions. So on my lifestyle channel, I'll cover health products. I'll cover different things. So I was talking about some green juice powder in this video. And it's just something you mix with water, kind of like healthy, whatever. And the affiliate commission is 30% on this product, so much higher. On Amazon, most of the tech I review is 4%. And so it's 30% on this product and it's continuity. So if somebody subscribes and is like, yo, that stuff's good, I just want that every month, then you actually get paid every month whenever that's renewed and it could just scale for years. So this one video actually generates somewhere between two to three hundred dollars a month. It's been doing that for a couple years and I made it a couple years ago. And because it, the reason it could do that high is because it's higher ticket and higher commissions. Uh, Pat Flynn spoke here, just crushed his session. Pat is the best, man, love Pat. And Pat uh, runs Smart Passive Income. One of the companies he works with is ConvertKit as an affiliate. And because he's able to add a lot of value and really go deep with ConvertKit, he's able to do really well as it pertains to affiliate marketing and that software. This is Michael Hyatt, a leader I really respect, love his blog, love his content. He sells digital courses, personal development. And so a lot of times in the industry, you'll get 50% commissions if you recommend someone course, their digital course, their online program. And so he'll launch a productivity program called Your Best Year Ever. If you sign up as an affiliate and people sign up, he'll give you 50% commissions. That could cost $400. You'd earn $200. There's packages that cost $800. I think if you upgrade with that, you're going to earn $400. Do you see how powerful this is? Yeah? yeah? Awesome. All right, number seven is solve search problems. Solve search problems. There it is again. Solve search problems. Anybody here drink coffee? Wave at me. Wave at me. Wake me. Come on, man. That's it. That's it. I wouldn't be standing right now if I hadn't had some coffee today. I'd just be laid down on the stage. It wouldn't be that interesting. You're like, dude, this guy has a lot of energy. Man, this guy crushes a lot of coffee, man. Let's go. But uh, 
you know, I, I, I try to pay attention to just my everyday life to look for opportunities like this. And so one of those opportunities was I uh, was gifted a Starbucks Verismo machine. And that Starbucks uh, Verismo machine um, uh, ultimately, uh, the pods are really expensive. So I started trying to buy pods for this machine. And, uh, and uh, I was looking for ways to save money. I eventually fi figured out that CBTL pods, a different brand, work in the machine. Like, they fit. Then I went to the research, and I saw that people were actually wondering, like, do CBTL pods work in a Verismo? And where do you get Verismo pods cheap? And so, because I was paying attention, I put out a video. That video ranked in search. And there I am. I'm like, yo, do the pods work in this? Let's see. And then I show it. I'm like, they do. And people are like, cool. And if you want to check out coffee, there's links in the description to get these pods. It's what I drink when I do it in the machine because there's more variety and they're cheaper. So it's super cool. Link in the description. And the key here is all you got to do with this stuff is just add value and be helpful. Solve a search problem. Someone's like, hey, does this work? I'm like, yes. Thank you so much. You know, <laughs> you know? like that's it. Solve search Problem. So a power question is, what are the problems and questions your target audience is currently trying to solve? Ask yourself that. What is it they're looking for? You start putting out videos on the other side of those questions related to affiliate marketing, then you can crush it. Tip number eight, more videos, more money. You start putting out more volume of content strategically positioned as we're learning here in this session, you can earn more money. So I mentioned gift ideas for him that I stumbled on years ago. I said, this worked a little bit. I made $2.12. What if I do this more? And I started to do it over and over again. So I was like, Mother's Day gift ideas, Valentine's Day gift ideas. My wife did gift ideas for women, uh, Christmas gift ideas 2015, 16, 17, 18. Don't really do these anymore, uh, but they're still out there. Gift ideas for creative people. You're like, dude. I became like the gift ideas guy for a little while. But, you know, you start doing more videos, more angles, more niches, more positioning, and uh, you can make a big impact. So ask yourself, how can you increase the quality and the quantity of your uploads? If your videos get better and they add more value and you upload more of them, strategically optimized like we're talking about, then you'll make more money. Pretty cool. And uh, tip number nine is audience intent. Audience intent. So what is the intent of the audience looking for? One of the biggest reasons people fail with affiliate marketing or they don't earn very much is they're trying to make it work with the wrong audience intent. So for example, if you had a, like a vegan health channel, you might type in something like best vegan protein powder, as people do, if I, did, I just did a little research. This is not my niche, I know nothing about this. I just typed it in, keywords everywhere. 18,100 people a month are like, what is the best vegan protein powder? Pretty cool. And so if you put a video on the other side, here's the thing, if someone types that in, they have their credit card in hand, and they're like, help me, I'm, I, by the end of the day, I need some vegan protein powder, right? That's their intent. Now if someone types in funny cat, right? They're in the, and maybe they want funny cat fails. By the way, funny cat videos, 165,000 searches a month. It's a lot more, and it's a big market, but that's not the right intent. Like no one's like, I'm, they're not trying to buy anything, they want to be entertained. This is why maybe as a vlogger, it could be a little bit harder to do affiliate marketing. You need to reverse engineer your niche, your audience, and figure out your audience's intent. So let's say you had a luxury watch channel, hypothetical. You type in Brentling nav timer versus say like the Speedmaster. These are $6,000 watches. So someone that's typing that in is probably maybe in a moment where they're like, look, I'm about to buy a watch. Which one do I get? At 4% commissions, if you sell one watch a month, that's $240 a month in profit, right? Super, super powerful. And so ask yourself, what is the intent of the viewer? And then tip number 10, tip number 10 is increase traffic, like increase traffic. If you want to scale and make more money with this, you need to get more views. Now, for time's sake, I'm going to wrap it up. But if you want to learn some of just my traffic strategies, things so how you can get more views on your videos, I actually do have a checklist. You can grab it for free tubechecklist.com and uh, that will break down how to get more views, how to scale and reach more people because when you increase that volume, you're going to be able to increase your income with affiliate marketing. Well, hey, thank you so much for coming out. Appreciate this work. So I hope you found those strategies valuable. And if you did, can you smash the like button? And if you haven't watched the other videos in this three-part series, make sure to watch the whole thing and there's a link to it in the description below. 
Now, I also mentioned some bonus resources and videos, and that's actually a series we just put together of a complete YouTube checklist and a three-part video series of how to get more views and subscribers. You know, that last tip we talked about in this video was you gotta get more traffic. When you get more views, you get more traffic, you're gonna be able to generate more income with YouTube and affiliate marketing. But how do you do that? That's what this free series is all about. So if you wanna check that out, it's at viralvideochecklist.com. There's a link to it in the description below. And just enter your email. We'll send you the checklist and the three-part series and I know you're gonna love it if you want to check that out question of the day have you already started doing affiliate marketing how's it going let me know and if you have any questions I would love to do future training videos to help you with any roadblocks challenges or questions so definitely post those in the comments section yeah.